Uh, welcome to part 38 of Pokemon Fire Red, where we're now continuing with Team Rocket shenanigans back on Five Island now. And no, I don't have Cut on me, which is really annoying there. Got the uh, HMO slave. Yeah, I haven't at this point, but yeah. I think I'm going to try and catch this thing just for shits and giggles. Because <laughs> it's cool so Pokemon. Its evolutions are cool. I don't like a cup of itself. Yeah, then skipping them. Oh, I don't like up. it. Yeah. I've kind of let it. It's just the thing that flies yeah. around. No, I don't need to nickname it. So yeah, it's at this point where I'm kind of sick of the Team Rocket stuff because like you're still fighting like like coffins, Zubats, Golbats, and I'm bored of that at this point. I just want to do something else. But I'll admit, once you get inside the base, there's some more like interesting Pokemon. I think one of them's got a Houndow and stuff like that. Houndow. Yeah. Hound or however you can pronounce it. There you it. go. Either or. Yeah. And what, one thing I've noticed at this point is where I'm cutting out all the repeated battles, it seems like I'm cutting out all the gameplay. <laughs> <laughs> Just because, like, I, we don't want to try and sit and watch yet another gold pack fight, but <laughs> now there's nothing left. <laughs> And at this point, I need another password. <laughs> <laughs> so now we've got another mission that I completely forgot of that I was meant to do. Just kick the door in. <laughs> that would make sense, but it, it makes didn't. a reference. I think one of the Team Rocket ones says, uh, "You look like Giovanni's kid." No, yeah. right here's red hair. Yeah, that was like the first time that they'd officially teased it before yeah. they finally made it canon in Gen Four. Right? Yeah. And, I kind of think it's cool that they did make it canon. Yeah, yeah they did. Yeah, they introduced it with Syllabi, yeah. didn't they? Yeah. No, it's one of the things that Pokemon's done quite a few times, actually, where they've not really thought about something, but fans have came up with something for it and they've just thought, eh, why not? Yeah. <laughs> like, like the term shiny, uh, that's canon now, isn't it? That yeah. was never canon years back, but people just started using it. And it got to a point where like, Ash is even referred to the Shiny Onyx as sh Shiny yeah. Onyx. So they even stuck the word Shiny in the X and Y Pokedex when you look at the full differences. Yeah. So I always like, thought it was canon, to be honest. No, it never was back in Gen 2 when it first kind of happened. <laughs> it was just red Gyarados. Yeah. Different coloured Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, I think in Diamond and Pearl they did still use the alternate coloured Pokemon when they mentioned it, but Thing from Heart Gold, Soul Silver onwards, it was shiny. I don't know. <laughs> and I don't like this area because it's like very walking around, easy to get lost in. And it's just not much really to it outside of some interesting Gen 2 Pokemon as wild encounters. So, yeah. yeah. I'm not really clocking on to where I'm meant to go at this point. <laughs> Find you. Yeah, you're always a bit slow. Uh -huh. But we gotta go fast. <laughs> Wait, we did wrong game. I want the item. All right. <laughs> uh, I think you might have got it stuck. Not this time. I'm getting better at these. Come on. Fuck oh, you! You can trap yourself in. Uh, I don't think you can. But yeah, being able being able to move two boulders without much trouble is actually quite an achievement for you. Yeah, I know. How close did I have to get to him then? One square, yeah, he's forgiving. He has terrible eyesight. Yeah, I thought because he didn't come at me straight away that he might just be like a different trainer, more. different person or something. Yeah. yeah. But no, supposedly not. No, he just wanted you to get close, so. Yeah. He's just a lazy annoyance, that's what it is. Yes. Oh, it's another ruined maniac guy. Well, I'm, curi I'm curious oh, yeah. what compelled you to come here. Story. <laughs> yeah. Would it be yeah, funny though if they had different tra uh, trainer types for like different people of the internet? <laughs> so like you got the trolls, you yeah. got the do bros. <laughs> you got the, you got that one obligatory guy on YouTube who shouts yeah. a lot and he's really racist for no reason. <laughs> yeah, he's uh, Pokemon would be uh, explored. <laughs> yeah, just really loud. Yeah. <laughs> These are all just grouped into the trainer group known as retards. <laughs> <laughs> yes. These are the bad. Their mate's got to be beat off. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> just no, be doof, but with its tongue like just sticking out at you. <laughs> are you, are you <laughs> insulting our Lord and Saviour, be doof? Yeah. Anyway, it's at this point I feel like all right, knob, because that's a prompt to use cut, but I didn't think of that. So now, I haven't got a Pokemon with a cut, so I'm gonna have to teach it to me, Nido King. Oh God! <laughs> yeah, I know. I should feel terrible, but I couldn't be asked to backtrack. Okay. <laughs> Oh, double nah, I dig. Because I've got two ground types, so I've only got one fighting type there. Oh, yeah. mm, double kick is actually really useful when you're like grinding Geo dudes in the yeah. <laughs> victory road okay. Plus, it covers its weakness for ice type moves, but that doesn't matter to you. Nah. <laughs> no, I don't actually think about what I'm doing. <laughs> yeah. So, you've got to cut this door open, which is. It's kind of interesting what they're doing with Braille, but it still makes no sense, really. <laughs> Best description ever, dotted hole. Yeah. Uh, oh, this section. Just imagine if you got this game and you don't have the internet. You're fucked. <laughs> well, no, because in the instruction book, it's got a translation guide for Braille. Really? Yeah. yeah. I know because I actually own physical copies of both of them games. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> and there, there's an emerald as well because there's some of the extra bits in emerald kid file. Well, no, I assume that's for the Reggies. Yeah, uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah. There's a sapphire. <laughs> and if you can't tell what I was doing, I was counting the letters <laughs> for each of the instructions. I obviously left and down have the same number of letters, so I just got it right once and just went with it. <laughs> He's telling us one, not realising that we actually have the other one too. <laughs> More inspirational shit. This could be the secret of everything here. <laughs> could be the meaning of life. <laughs> a lot. Yeah. No, I uh, couldn't be asked to translate uh, this. I want to play a game. <laughs> no, you don't. You want to translate. This bro. could be the reason why you're not good at puzzles. <laughs> <laughs> well, because I don't pay attention to what I'm doing. <laughs> Probably because I'm filthy casual like that. I'm flying with me. <laughs> anyway, we've got to go back to that area on Five Island now to like, go back to the base, but it doesn't let you fly there. You've got to go to Six Island and then get the boat back to Five Island. You can't it's just cool. zoom out and then. I don't think so, no. Or you can, and I'm an idiot, but. No, I was <laughs> just saying in general, you can't. Oh. 